Armando Kulas of Goa, especially from Kutturi, was born and brought up in Kutturi, came to Panjim to do my studies in Don Bosco High School. I loved football right from the beginning. In my village in Kutturi, I used to play with the kids. I enjoyed playing. I lost my dad when I was four years old. My mother took care along with the priest of Don Bosco High School, especially for the Kasti, who gave me free education there. So that was the best thing to happen to me. And then I slowly, as I was growing up, I realized that football is my everything. Then I came and joined the Don Bosco School, who were good in inter-school tournaments, football. My grandmother was to apply oil every day to me, to tell me there are two ways in making a name, getting a name for yourself, either doing by very good things or by doing very bad things. And that was always put in me, because I was always trying to be best in the school, in the auditory, and that really helped. When I was studying in Don Bosco's and playing in Don Bosco's, I used to see the Empo Sports Club, the great huge stout players with full white uniform come and practice at Don Bosco High School ground. And I used to admire them. And then there was inner feeling in me, why, don't, why won't you play one day to this club? And I started slowly. We started playing. I joined Don Bosco Auditory. Father Edward de Souza did everything. And then when I was playing, Everybody watched me, especially the Empos, and they took me. Okay, so I'm glad that my ambition, whatever I had aspired earlier, as my dream has turned into a reality. The coach was from Bangalore, Mr. Joseph Ratnam. He was like a fatherly figure to all of us. He always used to come and watch the games at Kampal ground. He also loved football, so he used to walk from near Don Bosco's to Kampal ground and sit and watch all the games. And he liked me. And he said, I'll take you to the Empos. And he took me to the Empos. I was around 18 years old, 18 or 19. Yeah. I played all the positions for the Empos except goalkeeper. I was lucky, I'm one of the rarest few ones who not only coached, I mean, not only played for the Empos, but also coached at the Empos. And I'm lucky and I'm proud, honored, privileged to say that under my tutelage, the Empos have won five I League titles. No other coach has ever won what I've achieved. Uh, for the last uh, one and a half year, it's been close because of, you know, pandemic is all over the world. Uh, the fright is there with all of us. Although GFA did start some games, but that was closed with uh, uh, Corona certificates and all everything. I'm the secretary of this Agassa Youth Club here. We can't do anything on this ground because nobody wants to come here. Okay, so we're waiting. Once the ground stadiums in Goa open to, to start and do all the activities here, the parents are frightened to release the kids to come here and practice here to train because they still the social distancing, wash your hands, okay. And the fright, so many people in Goa have died. Forget about all India, but but here in Goa also, so many of them have died. So the fright is still there. It's good. I think uh, I've read that 70% of the people have been uh, vaccinated. There are three, 30 percent still there, reluctant because they are confused what will happen after that. Am I really strong? Football, going to rock, tanaha.